Lauren obviously is getting great exposure right now. Stop <laughs> boring your eyes into me. Um, and, and it's true, she is, and we're very happy and proud of her um, for that. But she knows, because we make sure that she knows, that Idol and Voice, they are television shows. I mean, season 14. Mm -hmm. So th it's, it's, it's onward and upward, right? I mean, they're thinking about the next season, but my job is to think about her and any other student that's on it. And so before she even went to this audition, there were plans set in place of, okay, this is what we're going to do during and after to capitalize on your exposure. For instance, I've been asking Sister Girl to write music for four years. Hasn't happened. So, huh. So I said, all right, I'm, she's gonna sing on a song that I wrote, you know, and that will, that will give her original music that when fans of hers love her and know her on Idol, they can see and hear something other than the things that she's saying. And it'll be immediate because we already, we already have it. Already so we've shot a music video for it. We recorded a song. We have some covers that we're going to release on YouTube. And we're going to build off of this momentum after she's finished, whenever that may be. And the whole yeah. reason that she's even doing Idol in the first place is because she wants to be the lead in a Broadway show, in particular, The Lion King first. Mm -hmm. If anyone's watching, and, you know. <laughs> just saying. <laughs> I would love to see her going and using this this clout that she's now built for herself to go and audition for some Broadway shows and to ramp up her resume in more ways than even that, just to add to her film credits and, and her to do whatever Tara tells me. And basically to do everything I tell her to do.